campaign 2020, former voice for, Vice President Joe Biden will take center stage at the fourth and final night of the Democratic National Convention. After this walkthrough earlier today, he'll officially accept his party's nomination for president in just a few hours. Joining me now, Margaret Brennan from CBS News' Face the Nation. Margaret, thanks so much for your time this afternoon. Some people love this year's DNC for being succinct. It's taped. You kind of get a, a highlight reel. Conversely, <laughs> others feel like it's lifeless or contrived. Now, seeing the Democrats' playbook, how do you think the Republicans might play it differently? What we know is uh, the current president, Donald Trump, is very much a showman. He worked in show business and he can uh, watch what's happening this week and try to put on a better show uh, for a sometimes captive audience, given uh, how little most of us are getting out these days. That said, uh, it, it, looks, um, it looks like the president will try to make things feel more presidential and less uh, adapted to the pandemic. Duly noted on all those points. So what can we expect from Joe Biden's speech tonight? Should he talk more about himself, your expectation, attack the president? And frankly, do you think he'll stay on prompter tonight, ad lib, off script? What, what's your call? I would expect Joe Biden to stay on prompter, on message. This is uh, the third time he has run for president and he has never made it this far. 31 years ago was the first campaign he ran for the presidency. At age 77 today, he has gotten the party's nomination and he will accept that tonight. You can hear him uh, likely lay out the case to the country as to why he's ready on day one, given his experience in the Situation Room during the Obama years, uh, and also uh, that idea that he's ready for the 3 a.m. phone call, so to speak. All right. Margaret Brennan, host of Face the Nation. Thank you for your insight. And Illinois Senator Tammy Duckworth will also be speaking at the convention tonight. Be sure to watch CBS2's special coverage, Joe Biden's speech tonight at 9.